everyone. Thank you for um, coming back into a Samantha Dixie Girl. Just want to let you know, uh, I was wanting to share about our garden here that I plant with my dad every year and how we manage it here. So I was going to show you what we have. We have some onions that was actually grown here last year. <laughs> but there's not many of them because we have been eating on them, but they are very good and the best, best kind you can ever have is these Vidalia onions. And we have lots of Sweet 100 cherry tomatoes that is great to be putting in salad. And there's nothing like these tomatoes really, honestly, to have homegrown um, on, your, on your food that you have, that you plant and grow, which I'm sure you guys know that too. But these are so good. You can do a lot of things with these too. There's lots of different recipes, of course, all kinds. So we have like three different kinds of those sweet 100. They're right here. This is also sweet 100. As you can see, the vines are just completely filled with all of these tomatoes. Wonderful sweet tomatoes. So there is tons. And hey everyone, welcome back to Samantha Dixie Channel. Um, you know, before when I very first one of my few videos, I showed you the garden for when it was actually plump and great and it was growing so well and it did do good this year except for a couple of things but now i'm going to show you that it has died down it's time of the season now but it's like at the end of it so we don't have much fruit that we can get now to actually enjoy except for some peppers and they are still good that we can use and put into our food so all of the tomatoes and the great wonderful tomatoes are died down now as you can see And we're going to have to work on um, the fall time. We'll probably be planting some other stuff for the fall. So turnip greens, things like that. So all of the tomatoes are gone. The eggplant this year, the eggplant this year didn't do as good and did not taste as good as I liked from what we had before. Uh, this was actually a different kind of eggplant. So um, next year we'll do a different kind. So and those are died down now also. And as you can see, still they look so green, but a lot of it has died down from all of the tomatoes that we did get, which were really good and great and delicious. And we're going to have to do a little bit better about putting them up next year. Um, these things grew to be humongous. So hopefully this next year we're going to be much more prepared. And these are the peppers. The jalapenos have been the best that we have got and still getting right now. And still putting on a little bit more bloom to be able to use in the food. We use a lot of the jalapenos and serranos. And this is banana pepper and it's it's actually still giving on the banana pepper right here. Um, so, and it's actually still putting, putting out. As you can see, there's still a little bud. A little buds, they're, they're growing. They're very good too, very good. And the cucumbers that were here, the, cu the cucumbers that were here uh, <clears throat> are gone now. Those actually ended quite, really quite early this year. Um, but we did get quite a good bit from there and they were delicious. And now as we go to the bell peppers, actually one's been pulled up, it's dead. It's already died out and gone. We do have two that is still producing though bell pepper so these have kind of went in for this um, part of the early fall is still giving some fruit this one too actually this one too and it's actually um this is an orange one so I wanted to do different kinds of peppers this year so instead of just the green and that's it that's what has happened this part time of the year um 
everything kind of tends to die down. So then you can think about winter time if you want to plant other stuff. Like usually people do turnip greens and Brussels sprouts and uh, different different stuff like that. So, but hopefully we'll have that going. Maybe we'll see where that goes. So. Thank you for watching me at this time of seeing how the garden has went along now at the end of the season.